a highly decorated high school player, showed up at San Diego State with high expectations placed on him by both the fans and himself. But what makes Lionel Hamilton special is that he started delivering on those expectations in his very first game of his very first college football season. Year one was one for the history books. Hamilton became the first true freshman in Aztec history to rush for more than 100 yards in a season opener. He became the first Aztec since Marshall Falk to be named first team freshman All-American, and he became just the second freshman in the history of the Mountain West Conference to be named first team All-Conference. Hamilton was also the league's freshman of the year, becoming the first ever Aztec to win that honor. And you want to talk about some crazy numbers, Hamilton ran for 1,087 yards his freshman season, and he missed the last two games with a broken ankle. A fully recovered Hamilton will be a key cog in the Aztec offensive attack in 2004. One preseason magazine has named Hamilton as the best NFL prospect in the Mountain West Conference, and the soft-spoken slasher is just entering his sophomore season. I'm looking forward to just doing my job as a running back, and to be there for my team as a leader as well. It's perfect blocking, perfect running the ball, perfect catching the ball. And winning games is about having big plays, and I want to be the man on the team who know how to make big plays for my team. I think Lionel Hamilton uh, leads a great group of running backs. Also, Michael Franklin and freshman Brandon Bourne should be a key to our run game this season. Jeremy Justice will take the pressure off the wide receivers, led by Jeff Webb, who's one of the top receivers, I believe, on the West Coast. And two offensive linemen returning, Jasper Harvey and Mike Cracklick, are going to anchor a, a good, big, strong Aztec offensive front. Jasper Harvey is up for the Remington Award. Mike Krakalik's on the Outland watch list, and of course Jeremy Justice is on the Mackey watch list. So those are three players that are on national watch list. They're exciting players that'll lead the offensive line up front. Football, it's on. Season tickets. School history, the Aztec publications, we're excited about that, and it's a new position for us, and we've worked real hard to get there, so really excited about our defense this year, a lot of returning starters, and an exciting offense. It's going to be a great year. Mr. Hamill. We're so eager to play. It's very important for the fans to come out September the 4th so we can show them that we're the real deal. Beautiful. Kurt? We're going to go give it our all, every play, every game. It's our time to show the nation what San Diego State football is really all about. Gentlemen, thank you very much for joining me. Fans at home, thank you for sticking around. And we will see all of you at the queue this fall for Aztec football. After all, it's on, right, guys? And guys, let's go back and watch Drew Brees' footwork and his look to the left and the fake pump. And he came right back right, put it on a line. Eric Parker taps his feet. Big time play, big time throw and catch. And I'll tell you, this Chargers offense has looked pretty good. And we thought the Texans were going to be really improved. And there's Drew Brees. And you can see the look of intensity. And you noticed it earlier. He's not out there celebrating. He's focused. We're in the fourth quarter. We're on the road. That's what he's thinking about. He's going to have another opportunity to have to go out there and execute. First down and 10 now for David Carr and the Texans at their own 40. Play action. Carr finds his cool back out of the backfield. Baxter. And Baxter is wrestled down by Ben Lieber. 23. Carr in the shotgun. Carr steps up. Carr in trouble. And he goes down at the 44. Sean Phillips, fourth round pick out of Purdue. The all time sack leader for the Boilermakers with his first as a charger. And watch Phillips coming on the outside. You see that arm roll, and he stays with it. Gets his arm back, comes back, and I think he had four sacks during the preseason. Marty Schottenheimer said, you got to watch out for this guy. Heat the 23. Big play for both teams. Here's Breeze in trouble. Sack at the 14-yard line. So, Chargers are full. Here's Davis, the single setback. Carr changes the play at the line of scrimmage. Davis with a huge hole. Dominic Davis stopped 
at the 25-yard line by... Corey Bradford out of bounds. At the 17, Davis. Stutter stepping. And he gets inside the 15. They say he dropped the ball. And they're not blowing that whistle, and it's a battle to see who ends up with it. I saw Davis trying to pull it back into his bread basket, but it was tough because it was down by his Oh, my goodness. Knee. San Diego recovers. Car interceptions to Dominic Davis fumbles for the Texans. Third down and four for the Chargers at the 33. They have to stop him here. They hand it off. Tomlinson outside. Tomlinson around the corner. First down, San Diego. And that should do it.